As for the East Noble Knights, the squad is looking to bring in some more wins this season. The Knights finished with a 6-4 record last year, going 5-2 in conference play. Now, out of the last three years, the 2019 season was definitely their best year. The team went 14-1. The one loss came in the state title match against Evansville Memorial. Now, this year, the squad will be without former senior stars Rowan Zolman and Nick Munson, but the expectations for the team are still the same. The goals are always championships. We just want to keep working, keep winning, preferably state, but it's a young team, so we're going to have to compete. We need all our returning guys to just do better than they did competing, and then our young guys to just fill those spots that we're missing. Obviously, we're a championship program, and I think that's an expectation that we have every day that we come in, every, like, every season that you walk in the door here. It's just an expectation when championships, you go compete for a sectional title, you go compete for the conference title, and that's just one of our goals every time we walk in the door. For 20 years at East Noble, uh, uh, not a class has ever come through that didn't experience winning a championship of some type. Uh, and that's not going to be any different. We're, you know, we want uh, every one of these kids to have a great football experience, but we want them all to uh, you know, come in and expect to win every game and, and win the conference, win the sectional, and get to the state finals. And um, you know, That may be more realistic in some years than others, but you know, we feel like we've always got tough enough kids that if you get hot at the right time, some great things can happen. East Noble will open the season at home against Plymouth.